on today's menu, a delicious recipe so easy to make, you won't have a lot on your plate. An incredibly savory turmeric rice. Lei ho ma, that's how's it going in Cantonese. I'm Will Young from youngmancooking.com. Welcome to the channel where you can cook with confidence. We've made a lot of easy, uncomplicated weeknight noodle recipes here on the channel, but today we're going to make a delicious, simple weeknight rice recipe. Let's begin. Reheat the oven to 400. One 400 ml can, chickpeas. Strain out the chickpea water or aquafaba and use in other recipes. Rinse and drain the chickpeas with some cold water. One teaspoon onion powder. One teaspoon garlic powder. One teaspoon smoked paprika. Pinch of salt. About a teaspoon of avocado oil. Toss. Transfer the chickpeas to a baking tray lined with parchment paper. Spread out the chickpeas and bake in the oven for about 30 minutes. One cup basmati rice. Rinse and drain the rice a couple of times, get rid of the excess starch. Feel welcome to use any other rice in this recipe, it'll work out just as tasty. One red onion, finely chopped. Two to three pieces of garlic, thinly sliced. One long green chili pepper, thinly sliced. Half a red bell pepper, finely chopped. Simple enough, that's basically all of the prep done. Now this wouldn't be young men cooking complete without the use of some delicious ruby red smoky spicy chili oil I made in the previous episode. And I'll leave a link in the description box below for you to check this out, make this really easily at home. This by default has so much aroma, it will really just next level this delicious rice dish. Saute pan, medium heat, two tablespoons chili oil, red onions. Saute the onions for five to six minutes. Take your time and give the onions the opportunity to caramelize. Green chili peppers, garlic. Saute for a couple of minutes. Half teaspoon turmeric, one teaspoon smoked paprika, half teaspoon salt. Saute for a couple of minutes. Rice. Give the pan a good stir. Red bell pepper. Saute for a couple of minutes. One cup, water. 
give the pan a good stir and ensure the rice is submerged in the liquid. When the water begins to bubble, turn the heat to medium-low. Be sure the rice is submerged, then cover and cook for 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, turn the heat off and let the rice steam further for another 5 minutes. Be sure not to forget about the chickpeas, for they should be nice and crispy. The rice is just about done. Now, if you're new to the channel, welcome. I'm glad you're here. Definitely check out or pick up your copy of one of the three Young Men Cooking cookbooks over on the online shop. These have most of your favorite recipes from the cooking show here on YouTube. I'll leave a link in the description box below for you to visit that online shop. Now, let's check out that amazing rice. Take a moment to admire that beautiful rice. Add in half the crispy chickpeas or the entire pan. It's completely up to you. Gently fold the rice with the chickpeas. If you find large chunks of garlic, be sure to accidentally plate them in your own bowl. Plate the rice generously. Garnish with some fresh cilantro. You can now enjoy this incredibly savory dish with absolute confidence. Visually, that just looks sensational. Look at that. Wow, you really get that pop of amazing flavor. There really is that heat from the chili pepper and the spicy chili oil. That really just kind of adds this extra layer of fragrance and this extraordinary aroma that just gets absorbed into that delicious fluffy rice. That turmeric and the sweet paprika really turns the rice this beautiful, stunning golden color. And you get this delicious contrasting texture from that fluffy rice with those crunchy chickpeas that were roasted to just perfection. And they have this garlicky, smoky flavor. The red bell pepper adds this really nice pop of red color and this bit of sweetness and acidity. And that cilantro really helps lift up this dish with that kind of freshness. The red onion really just melts together with that rice and you get these amazing chunks of garlic that is just colored with that turmeric. So simple to put together. I would say that this recipe is about two to three portions depending on how hungry everybody is, of course. But boy, this would make a fantastic side dish or just by itself. It is so exciting to be able to make delicious, tasty, simple, uncomplicated recipes like this right in your very own kitchen. If you absolutely love easy and delicious recipes like me, then definitely check out or pick up your copy, one of the three Young Man Cooking cookbooks over on the online shop, which I'll leave a link in the description box below for the checkout, along with the Young Man Cooking merch and plant-based sushi masterclass. If you're not already subscribed with that notification bell clicked, definitely do so so you won't miss a single episode.